Marche, a music specialist, and I'm here to give you five ways to teach cooperation in your classroom using music. I'll start with my favorite cooperation song for elementary kids. This works for preschool too. Working Together in the Sun from the CD Nature Nuts. This is a great song for using what is called hand jive. You start with the hands on your lap and then you cross your arms, cross back, and then put your hands up. Sometimes you'll be touching other students. Oh my goodness. For second and third graders, learn it first without partners. Then do it with a partner where the partners are tapping hands. And then do it in a circle where you'll be touching hands to the right and left. Very challenging for second and third graders. For preschoolers and kindergartners, just crossing the midline is enough. That's a great enough challenge. Now while you do this hand jive, you sing the chorus. So I'll sing it for you and show you how it goes. Working together in the sun. Working together in the sun. Working together in any kind of weather. Working together is fun. Oh yeah, you have to throw up your hands in the air and yell fun on the word fun. So for the verses, you do hand motions that illustrate the words. Up the ground, we plant the seeds. The rain comes down and we pull the weeds. The corn comes up, the sunflowers hang down. The beans grow long and the pumpkins grow round. Here goes the chorus. Working together in the sun. Working together in the sun. Working together in any kind of weather. Working together is fun. You can make up the motions for the rest of the verses, or you can view the entire song with all the hand motions on my website, marymache.com. There are other kinds of cooperation songs that I sing about with my students, and Red Grammar's song, Use a Word, is perfect for reminding children to use their words. I like to have children use their pointer finger when yelling the phrase, use a word. You can find it on the CD, piece it together. If you want to sing one of the most beautiful children's songs about living with and appreciating people of different colors and styles, it has to be Greg Schelsa's song, The World is a Rainbow, on Piece It Together CD. This is one of the best songs ever. I like to teach it to my students and then perform it for parents. Again, you can find it on marymache.com if you'd like to see the whole song with the hand motions. I love all the music by the children's artist Linda Arnold, but my favorite of hers for teaching cooperation is Find a Peaceful Thought. So find a peaceful thought and plant it in your heart. Maybe then a peaceful world would really start to grow. I love it that Linda created this song by asking children to find their own peaceful thoughts. This song is great to use as a writing prompt for second or third graders. Here's what it sounds like with the children singing their own verses. Having homework, peace is yummy, chocolate sundae. Peace is showing someone that you care. Well, you made it this far with me, so stick with me for just one more song. I'd like to teach the world to sing. This was a really big hit in the 70s, and it's still a great song to sing with kids. You can find the children's version of it on the CD, Piece It Together. This song lends itself to creating beautiful drawings by the children of how they vision the world living in cooperation and peace. You can play it while they sing along and draw at the end of a busy day. Thanks so much for your interest in teaching music what we need most in our future world, not competition, but cooperation.